and I get enough vasoconstriction mm -hmm. that when I go in with my cannula, I get yellow fat. So I don't get almost no red blood cells. So I do a couple of washes and I'm good. Now, um, since the patient is completely uh, general anesthesia, they probably didn't put epinephrine on it. So that's why it's so bloody. So then you, you struggle with that because you have to wash that a lot of time and you have to wait. Local anesthesia? Local. I do bone marrow in local. Oh, it's a Klein solution. Let me write it down there. It's called Klein solution or tumescent. Klein is the dermatologist that invented um, smart lipo. Back in the 80s, the morbidity of liposuction was about 60%. Why? Because surgeons would go, the pa they would bring the patient in, they would intubate the patient, and they would go right in there with their cannulas in the belly, breaking down fat, uh, aspirating, breaking down blood vessels you had. Then hematomas, you had a lot of blood loss, you had embolies. So now this guy said, wait a minute. And mind you, the tumescent anesthesia was not invented by him, was invented by the Russians in World War II, where they were mixing uh, lidocaine with uh, warm saline to inject people with frostbite. For, to manage the pain. So this guy added epinephrine to the mix. That's where his genius was. So the preparation is uh, 500 of normal saline, mm. uh, 20 ml of 2% lido, and one ml of epi uh, one in 1,000. That's a clean solution. The, now, this is a standard that I use for liposuction when I'm gonna do adipose derived cells. Now, you infiltrate that in the adipose tissue and then what I do is I wait 20 minutes. Oh. If I wait 20 minutes, this works. It and it produces enough vasoconstriction that I go in with my cannula and I don't have blood or very little blood. 